And you see the uh, second half numbers. Miami leading uh, at the half of each of the four games, but uh, plus 65 in the second half. Philadelphia plus 42 in the fourth quarter through four games. Of and he has, as a result, one of the most scrutinized shots throughout the course of the season. But he's back and healthy now, and he makes it a six-point game at the end of the first 12 minutes. Two guys from each team making right. big contributions. Well, then it goes one for two. And that's the end of the first half of play. Miami leading by four. He's got 19 offensively. Five to go. Winslow weaving on the baseline. Adebayo couldn't get the follow. Ilya Sova. It won't count. But that's the type of game it's been tonight for Ersan Ilyasova Castle. Also a record given up by Miami. Miami has got to break this down and say, whoa, what, what, what happened here? How, how could it happen? Because it didn't happen when we played you four times there in the year. Yeah. The four games were decided by an average of a little over four points, but this was uncharacteristic tonight in Philadelphia. Wiped out quickly, Balladelli, a little fadeaway is good. Bellinelli off to a fantastic start for Philadelphia. Clock winds down, here's Ray, goes. And that takes us to the end of the first quarter. Justice Winslow with a terrific Lea Silva. Runs into trouble, gives it up. On a bio, yes! The rookie scores, and Miami is on top. Simmons. And a former MVP here in those chants once again. I like the Tennessee honey. Try <laughs> one of those maybe after the end of this game. Two for two for Dwayne Wade. Or maybe during the fourth quarter. <laughs> right, right now's a good time. Final shot is up and if it goes, it does not. And we are set up for a dandy of a finish. DJ McConnell letting Dwayne Wade hear about it. 96-94, the Sixers have a lead. is going to be fun. Well, Eric Spolstra, following a loss in a series in the postseason, he's one of the winningest coaches in the postseason. Right now, fifth best winning percentage. But following a loss, he is plus 13. 26 wins, 13 losses. Navigated a win after a loss in game two, and he'll try to do the same for game four. Sixers made 18 threes in game one. They make 18 tonight, and they win it. 128-108. Ellington, step back three. Yes. Five to go in the first quarter. Reddick gives it back to Ilya Soma. Long three is up. Play the rebound. And that will take us to the end of the first quarter. All tied at 26. A 9-2 Miami run. Ilya Soma and Johnson got a piece of that. Oh, that is big league defense by the Heat. Trying to cash it in for points before the half. It is way no. It's a count if it goes. Just short. A flurry of activity. Two teams put it all on the floor. 61-56 Miami. Wade with nine in the corner. There's Simmons with Dwayne Wade on him. About a second separating shot clock and game clock. Ilya Sova, Embiid, in the high post, gives it up, Bellinelli now, Bellinelli to Ilya Sova, three-pointer is up, and it is good, Ersan Ilya Sova, it's a four-point game, and that'll take us to the fourth quarter, Philadelphia on the road, a surge in the third, down four, Richardson backing down McConnell, comes up short, Richardson pokes it to Johnson. It comes up short. That is Simmons with the board. And Philadelphia is going to take this one home. A 3 1 in a hard fought win in game four. 106 102, the final of 3 1 returning to Philadelphia Tuesday. Here's Wade against Bill and Ellen. Ten seconds left in the quarter. Wade blocked by MB. Five seconds left, first quarter. Dellinelli crosses quickly, finds Simmons. 
Reddick for three. Well, first quarter closes with a two-point lead for Philadelphia. Home crowd on their feet as Simmons looks for the final shot. Two seconds left in the half. He missed it, and the first half ends, rightfully so, all tied at 46. First game that he did not have the lead at that time. That might be a good sign. I want to take that as a good sign. Ten seconds left, third quarter. Wade against McConnell. Nice pitch, wide open Winslow. Misses the three, and Bede with his 11th rebound. And the Sixers dominated the third quarter, and they'll take a 14-point lead into the fourth quarter on their home court. Well, Sixers taking control of the fourth quarter. The offense for the Heat here in the fourth quarter has disappeared. The well, Heat have been outscored in this fourth quarter, 27 to 14. Tony, there's been nothing easy for Miami. Not an easy shot, not even an easy pass in the fourth quarter. They're either not getting stops at one end and they're cold at the other end. They're not getting good looks at the rim. Philadelphia has dominated the four fourth quarters and the offensive rebounding for the 76ers persistent and destructive. Now the 76ers have outscored Miami in the fourth quarter of the, the, of the Heat's three losses by 15, 18, and 8. He'd have been outscored by a total of 65 second half points. Well, for Philadelphia, if they get Boston in the next round, they lost three out of four to the Celtics in the regular season. They split four games with the Bucks. And I'm going to go on record right now. I think Philadelphia beats whoever they play in the next round. I can't disagree with that. Well, hard fought. The only Heat win came in game two. And the season is about to be over for Miami. They take the shot clock violation and good sportsmanship now being shown by Miami. They're going to lose a first round series for the first time since 2010. It's over. It's over. The Sixers advance and the Heat season ends. The better team won the series. No doubt about it. You can live with that. The better team won. They lose the game by 13, 104 to 91. So the Sixers win the series four games to one. They'll meet the Milwaukee-Boston winner.